Hello, I'm Rahmatullah. I'm from Afghanistan. I'm 23 years old. I have been in Indonesia since 2014. I stayed in detention for three years. This is where I live now, in a refugee accommodation house. Here we cook. I'm trying to cook, you know, beans for dinner. These are our homemade dumbbells <laughs> that we made by ourselves and we sport here sometimes just to relieve from stress and anxiety. I want an opportunity to study. I would love a job where I could help people or a job in IT. Now it's 10 o'clock and the securities have already Close this gate, we cannot go out after 10 o'clock at night. And these are the rules and regulations from immigration that the refugees have to follow. Hi, I'm Holly Cassidy and I'm trying to help my friend find a home. Unfortunately, like many other refugees in Rahmat's situation, it's almost impossible to make it to my home in Australia because of the date he sought asylum in Indonesia. The UNHCR has told us that we will stay a long time here in Indonesia. We cannot work, study or travel. And if we don't want to stay here for a long time, we can go back to our countries, they said. Which is impossible for me now to go back. So now we're trying to focus our energy on the opportunity to get to Canada. As a mum and a teacher, it's almost impossible to fathom a 17-year-old making the journey to Indonesia alone. With Rama turning 24 in the new year, it's just about time we got him out of there. If you want to know more about Rama's story, connect with us or help raise money for Canadian sponsorship. Check out the links or drop us a line. Thank you. And I wanted to thank you all for trying to help the refugees and standing with their right. I really appreciate that.